Hello everybody. <laughs> this is our first day in Taipei. Taiwan. Taiwan. And um we <laughs> <laughs> We are we already fucked up because we haven't recorded anything. fucked up because we haven't recorded anything but that's only because we woke up late uh, around what 11 o'clock mm -hmm. got up missed breakfast so we decided we were going to find a bakery and we found one bought some cakes and went to a family mart and got some coffee ate there and that's where we got a thing called a easy card okay so at the family mart you can buy a easy card and the easy card the way that you can see if a Family Mart or a 7-Eleven has an easy card is there will have a symbol on their door and it will say easy card corp. Then you have a little kiosk that you can go to. It's not in English. So we did have a, a pretty interesting experience with the clerk. She used Google Translate to try and help us get an easy card and eventually we ended up getting one. And the easy card is where you add money to the card, it was three dollars, which is a hundred of their dollars. A hundred and Taiwanese new dollars. And so she helps you reload the card, you just put however much you want on there, and that is what you can use to pay for things at a family mart or a seven eleven or go to the train station and pick your tickets and pay for it that way. It's just like a super fast, simple way to pay for things instead of having to get change out and money to pay that way. So our plans now is to go to Elephant Mountain and I think it's going to take about 20 to 30 minutes uh, taking trains and walk, doing some walking. Uh, we're going to record everything and how to get there and how long it takes and how much everything costs. So stay tuned. Okay, so this is what the easy card looks like. You can get like whichever one that you want. They have Hello Kitty if you want to get Hello Kitty but uh, you pay for it with the barcode. You just gotta open it up, take it out. And then you have the thing you could tear off. And it comes with instructions, but they're not in English. But this is the symbol for the easy card. That's what it looks like. And it'll say Easy Card on it. And that's what you'll see on the uh, doors of uh, Family Mart and 7-Eleven. So this is how you pay for your tickets uh, for the train. Or if you want to buy something like in this store right here, Poya, we could have paid for our bag with this. And it comes with instructions, but can't read them. But that's okay, we'll figure it out. And now we're going to uh, Elephant Mountain, but we have to walk to the train station first and uh, purchase our tickets. So we'll see you there. So when you go to the train station, you'll have a kiosk, and the kiosk is where you put money on your easy card. Place your easy card on the platform and insert the amount you want to insert. On the screen it will show you your remaining balance and the amount that you inserted. Once you click next it will show you your current balance, your original balance and the amount you inserted. Then all you have to do is click receipt.
Park, or you can say Xing Shang Park. Um, we found out we had to buy two easy cards because it's one per person, and it's really cheap. You gotta pay in to get out, also. But the uh, ladies that work at the train station or the subway station, they speak English, so if you have any issues, they can help you out. And it's pretty easy to figure out how to get here, anyways. Well, we finally made it, and we had to take two different trains, but the maps. Some of them are in English mostly, so it's super easy to figure out where you gotta go. And we found it. It was pretty easy to find, so I guess you just follow the street signs, you see them everywhere. And here's the start of the hike. So I guess up we go. And we'll see you guys. We're actually taking a little break. I think she mentioned it's like 90 something degrees. So it's pretty freaking hot. And very humid. Is it humid? Yeah, it's humid. Somewhat. It wasn't humid this morning. Or this day, I feel like well, you can predict the humidity by my hair. <laughs> so we're going to take a little break here and then we're going we're gonna to keep going. I don't even know how much more we got, but we should be close. So I'm sure it'll be worth it. Yeah. So, all right. See you at the top. And here I am at the very peak. It looks beautiful up here. And we finally made it. far away. So that was that. It was ex ex exhausting. We're tired. Legs are shaking. And this was actually something free to do. So it's definitely worth it. Now we're just gonna walk around, probably try to get to Taipei 101, and definitely gotta find something to eat. Cause we haven't eaten anything but breakfast. And it is like 3 p.m. I believe. 4.25. 4.25. We ate breakfast like around 11.30. No, I don't want no rest. Echoing around these walls, fighting to create. We want one of each. One of these and one of them. Uh, the spicy is the meat. Uh, uh, for this one, yes. Uh, small, medium, and really spicy. Uh, Just a little bit? Medium, yeah. Medium, medium. We found a, uh, a restaurant type thing on the side of the road. It's like street food. And uh, each of our bowls is $2. And we actually had help from someone to be able to order these because nobody spoke English. So um, we're going to dig in. See what it tastes like. It's spicy. Yeah, it's good. It's good? Really good. Spicy? Not that much. But delicious. Yes, it tastes good. Good. Now let me eat. We got a short chopstick. <laughs> okay, take say bye. Okay, so we are back at our hotel room and 
after we ate our food, which was absolutely delicious, we went and walked towards our hotel, but stopped at a family mart to get something to drink and like a little snack. And so right now we're just editing some video footage so that we can upload this video for you guys. And we have somewhere we're going to go tomorrow. And in order for you guys to figure out what it's going to be, you have to stay tuned for our next video. So thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe and like this video. That way you can follow us and go on our adventure with us. Thank you for watching Travel with Leo and Mel, and see you next time.